Yes, what's everyone saying? Welcome back. Okay, so Decker Heggy and Martin Dibble, the podcast, will it take place? Um, now, after careful consideration, I've come to this conclusion. Um, Decker's recently made a video saying that he's willing and able to do it a Wednesday evening at the UK time. But unfortunately, we haven't heard back from Martin Dibble. No day, he's still doing the rounds on all the uh, Trolls channels, uh, getting his side of the argument out there. And that's the main problem we face. Now, we've had Decker's side of things on about 100 videos or more. We've had Martin doing the rounds on just about everybody's channel. You know, basically, the entire roster of uh, Decker's enemies. So we've heard his side of the story. Now, the idea for this podcast was to get them together. You know, so they can iron out their differences. They can both give their arguments and we can listen and give our opinion on who's right, who's wrong, who's telling the truth, who's stretching things, what not, what not. Um, but Decker said he will do it, but that's no good. Um, it's no good. Like I said, I've heard Decker's story a hundred times, no offence, and, you know, I don't particularly want to hear it. I know it'd still do great numbers, him coming on given his, his side, but that's not what this channel's about. I'm not out to, you know, make numbers, um, earn profit, you know, from other people's misery. Um, so unless the two heads can come together and agree, and, and by the way, I didn't agree to Wednesday night, I'm busy. I said Thursday evening, Friday evening, we could do something, but, you know, people have got to stop, you know, Changing days and times, um, but no, nah, it's not going to happen. It won't happen. Like I said, I didn't really want to get involved anyway. I don't really want to do it. But 50% of people, people telling me I should do it. 50% of people telling me I shouldn't do it. I, I don't follow the sheep. I always do things my own way, but my heart ain't really in it. I don't really want to referee between two grown-ass men squabbling over tittle-tattle, gossip, um, you know, and whatnot, you know, it's, it's, it's been done to death already, uh, so, like I've suggested, um, someone else could probably host it, Narrative Destroyer, there's not too many that are, um, unbiased on this corner of YouTube, so, there's, there's people that don't like Martin, there's people that don't like Decker, so, you can't please everybody all of the time, but, in, in other words, the short answer is no. Unfortunately, the podcast won't be um, taking place unless by some chance there's some miracle and um, Martin agrees to come on. But I don't think he will. Like I said, he always needs a backup. He always needs another YouTuber to support him and, you know, egg him on, you know, and basically feed him the answers, you know, so... He's just a puppet, so, no, and I'm not really, you know what, um, Martin, I see as a bit of um, a traitor, so, really, I, it's hard for me to um, look him in the eye, you know, when I see, because um, if he'd done that to me, if he'd been colluding with my enemies, and then collaborating with them on their channels, making them dull, making them more relevant, shh, shh, um, you know, <laughs> Shitting on me, basically, you know, I would be, I would be fuming, so, you know, and just to think, he offered me to go there, you know, he's, he was in the comments saying, I've got your passport, you know, we'll fire you out, don't worry about this, we'll pay for the cost, whoo, that was a, that was a close escape, trust me, you know, because me and him, we would have come to blows, because had he been colluding with my enemies, I would have just saw red, and I would have just, I would have just lamped him one, and he would have been Sparker, trust me, because when I lose it, I lose it, when it goes, I goes, I just go nuts, I just go crazy!